to make some roses and for that I'm using this leaf cutter and cutting some out of a piece of paper that I painted green on both sides. I'm using a heart shaped cutter to cut out some uh, crepe paper hearts in a color that I liked for my rose. I'm using a normal white school glue and I'm taking these small green leaves and dipping into the glue and I'm gluing them on a thin green flower wire. I'm making two pieces of wires with three leaves on there and two pieces of wire with five leaves on. Let the leaves dry and we can make the roses while we wait. I take another thin green flower wire and I dip the tip of it in this paper glue. Take one of the hearts and wrap it around the tip of it. I glue 8 to 10 small hearts on this rose and I always glue it with the hearts tip down. Just take a look here how I'm putting them together on the rose. I'm slowly building the rose up. I'm making around five or six roses, but you can make more if you want to. I give the leaves a tiny bit of glaze on one side. Now I put the roses together in a nice little bundle. I take the leaves and I put them outside of this bundle, so they are placed nice and even, looking like a little bouquet of roses. When I'm happy with my bouquet, I take a tiny piece of the green flower wire and I wrap it around the bouquet. Then I cut the excess wire and I take a tiny bit of super glue and I glue this wire in place so it won't come apart again. I cut the flower bouquet in the length I want it and that's all there is to this little rose bouquet. I hope you like this tutorial. Please like my video, comment and uh, happy crafting.